I do it every year. Oh, yeah. I'm 20, but I want to be married by 25. So this is the Sammy. New gym fit. Yo. Y'all gonna see me in six months and be like, wow, that girl got a gym body. I'm on the way. It's your girl, Saria Rain. If you're new to my channel, welcome. If you are not, welcome back. So as you see from today's title, this is another vlog. I'm actually about to do my makeup so that I could attempt to take some pictures by myself. I'll show you guys the whole entire process. Look at Hazel. <laughs> She's funny. But yeah, so I will come back to you guys when I have my makeup done. All right, y'all, I am in the area I'm gonna take pictures at in my apartment. But here is my makeup, and I'm gonna show you guys my fit. We looking great, but I, these are my first pictures of the new year. I just have on my, this came as a set, but the, the back, I don't know what that is, so we're not gonna show the back of any pictures. But this is the vibes. I love to get my jewelry on, got my jewelry on, got my jewelry on, all that hair done. Boy, my hair kind of messed up, so that's why I was like, I gotta take pictures today. Like, I have my glasses on my chest, cause I don't have no um, contacts in. So I'm low key gonna be like, in the dark. But I'm about to take them right here. Right here by this door. I'm gonna move the trash can. And I'm about to use a camera. Let me show y'all. We're gonna just show y'all the whole process. Camera. I'm scared. I've never taken pictures. Can y'all see me? I'm gonna take out the flag. I don't even know where to stand, but I'm just gonna. Okay, the flash is turn on. We're gonna redo that. Right here. I'll show you for eight seconds. Okay. All white background. All white matte background might do it. So I'm about to go over here. Because it's all white wall right here. If I figure this out, I'm going to put them on the screen, y'all. Because I don't know what I'm doing right now, honestly. All right, you guys. So I just got done filming, telling the girls, y'all probably, probably already seen that video. It's out already about my vision board party. If you're watching this and you watch my old video and you're still in about the vision board party, girl, I don't know what to tell you, girl. You don't want to, you don't want to change nothing about your life, girl. And that's okay. I ain't gonna keep begging. <laughs> I ain't gonna keep begging, but I will put the flyer on the screen. I'm ready to change you guys' minds, elevate the mindset so that you can elevate your money and be intentional about the goals and everything you put on that vision board for 2023. It's gonna come true. And I can tell you just how because I do it every year. I do it every year. I do it every year. Oh yeah. I was folding my clothes earlier, so I have clothes everywhere. I'm back inside. This picture should have been on the screen. But yeah, now I'm about to go ahead and edit that video. And I'm going to actually upload it tonight. It's gonna be my late upload, and then I'm gonna upload a vlog. I'm gonna upload a vlog tomorrow. But I'm about to probably take me some stuff because so I could. Yeah. I will get back to you guys. I don't know what I'm about to do. I'm gonna have to edit, obviously, so. Good morning, my beautiful, 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 beautiful people. So I just got done journaling and Bible studying, and I'm gonna come show you guys what I learned today in my Bible study. And I feel like I'm gonna do this every day that I'm filming, because I don't film every day, but every day that I'm filming, I'm gonna tell you guys what I did with my Bible study. So the biggest takeaway, well, I have a chronological Bible, by the way. It is linked down below on my Amazon store if you want the exact one that I read. I read Genesis, Exodus, Job, all of that stuff in the beginning of the book, but then I realized like what I was reading was not about now. So for a beginner or intermediate, I would consider myself intermediate. I'm not mastering, but I'm not a beginner. Is starting with Genesis, Exodus, and then you can do Job if you want to. I recommend Job. Job was a good one to read. We're not like the older times. So you shouldn't really start in the Old Testament. I feel like that is mastery, like low-key mastery. But this month, this morning, I was reading um, Matthew, Mark, and Luke. This is all around the same because it's a chronological Bible, so it has each person, like, thing at the same time. Like, it goes in order of time. So, Jesus was trying to tell people a story to teach. Like, he teached you through th th stories. So, the story was the story of the farmer scattering seed. So, I'm going to read it to you guys real fast. Don't click out the video. Don't be crazy. Let me read it to y'all real fast and then tell you the actual meaning of it. So it says, Once again, Jesus began teaching by the lake shore. A very large crowd soon gathered around him. So he got into a boat, then he sat in the boat while the people remained on the shore. He taught them by telling many stories in the form of parables such as this one. Listen, a farmer went out to plant some seed. As he scattered it across his field, some of the seed fell on the footpath and the birds came and ate it. Other seed fell on shallow soil with underlying rock. The seed sprouted quickly because the soil was shallow. But the plant soon wilted under the hot sun, and since it didn't have deep roots, it died. 
Other seed fell among thorns that grew up and choked out the tender plants so they produced no grain. Still other seeds fell on fertile soil and they sprouted, grew, and produced a crop that was 30, 60, and even 100 times as much as it had been planted. Then he said, anyone with ears, well, anyone with ears to hear should listen and understand. So when I first read it, I was like trying to put it in a way because it's an analogy. But I didn't get it. But I didn't get my phone yet because when I don't get things, I go ahead, get to my phone, and I Google it. But I kept reading. And basically, like when I'm understanding, I write on the side. Before when I first had my book, I didn't understand what those sides was for. Because I'm like, what do I do that for? I just read it. There's nothing else to do. But it's like when you're in school, you read a passage and you make a summary about it so that you understand what you read. This is what it actually means. You can't understand the meaning of this parable. How will you understand all the other parables? The farmer planted seeds by taking God's word to others. The seed that fell on the footpath represents those who hear the message only to have Satan come at once and take it away. The seed on the rocky soil represents those who hear the message and immediately receive it with joy. But since they don't have deep roots, they don't, it, they don't last long. The seed that fell on the footpath, which is when you're walking and then the birds came and took it away, represents those who hear the message only to have Satan come at once and take it away. The seed on the rocky soil represents those who hear the message and immediately receive it with joy. But since they don't have deep roots, they don't last long. They fall away as soon as they have problems or are persecuted for believing God's word, meaning embarrassment, whatever. The seed that fell among the thorns represents others who hear God's word, but all seed that fell among it say, the seed that fell among the thorns represents others who hear God's word, but all too quickly the message is crowded out by the worries of this life and the lure of wealth and the, and the desire of other things. So no fruit is produced. And the seed that fell on good soil represents those who hear and accept God's word and produce a harvest of 30, 60, or even 100 times as much as has been planted. That was my last passage today because tomorrow is a new day to read. But when I read that, I was like, I know this represents a lot of people because I've been in every single one of those stages. And I feel like to even get to the last stage, which is when you when you keep it in, it just stays there regardless. It takes each of those stages. Everybody's faith is on a different path. It's not just one quick month that you want it. It's not one quick year that you want it. I started reading the Bible maybe in the beginning of 2021, 2022, last year, January is when I start. I actually got a Bible and was reading it like how I read it now. That was my first time ever really reading it before. I would do little like passages. I didn't understand what the scripture was. I didn't understand too much. I didn't really go to church like that. My family, I'm, I didn't grow up in church. A lot of you guys probably grew up in church. And that was the thing that I was talking to Ayano about is like a lot of people grow up in the church. So it's in them. But then there's other people. I was talking about boys. Boys that are like Christ-like and stuff like my age right now usually grew up in the church. And if they're my age and they're going to end up being a Christ-like man, usually happens in their 20s. Somewhere in their late 20s, something happens, they turn their life over. Usually that's how it is. So I feel like that really stands out and I really felt the need to tell you guys that because y'all need to understand which one is you. You know, each to each his own. Everybody's not really to that point yet. Back to the Bible, you know, everybody's just on different levels in life. So, it's totally okay. She just loves us all. But, I am about to do those things. And I will see you guys in the next clip. But well, here is these packages. Boom, all this is done. I'm going to put them up in the bag soon. I also finished my video. Here it is. It's exporting right now. It is about my original party. Right here, it is 17 minutes long. And like I said, well, I don't know if I told y'all. I booked the wax today. I don't know if I told y'all or not, but I'm about to go ahead and get ready for that. I'm going to take a shower, get in the shower, clean up so when I get out, I can head out. So we are at the post office and I have my packages back there. But I'm about to go and take these packages up into this post office and check my P.O. box. I just want to check in with you guys and I'm going to get some food because I'm really hungry, bro. Yeah, I'm at my, well, I'm at Freddy's because I wanted to eat, but she's still here. I've been watching this video by Brini Lee about Erica Mena and Safari's relationship, bro. It's, I've been watching it the whole drive, so it's the time adding up. I'm just now getting to the rocky part of the relationship, so you know it's always good to learn from other people's mistakes. You don't want to go down the same road as other people. So that's what I'm doing right now. I will show y'all my food. Right, focus on me. I'm so freaking. I'm getting irritated. I ain't ate nothing all day. I got this big fat ass jacket on. Girl, back up. Fry sauce. 
They got some fry sauce. Here goes the fries. And here is the food. All right, y'all. Chili, chili dog. All right, y'all. Just got a wax, baby. If y'all want to know where I get my waxes, I get my waxes in Kanye's Brazilian Wax by Andrea. And I go to Delena. Tell her that I send you if you do want to come to her. I get sugar ring now. Um, this is my second time sugaring. Um, it honestly hurts the same if a little bit less. The only part that hurts worse is when the, the application. Because when you're applying it, you can feel your hair being pulled. But that's only really for me at the top. Like the top part. Whatever that top part called. Because, yeah. So, yeah, you guys. I am headed to my mommy's house. But I want to come in here real quick to you guys. If you haven't purchased a vision board party ticket, you need to do that, baby. Because we really going to be shifting minds there. It's an, a small investment of $45. Y'all spend that on weed. Be for real. You spend that on liquor. Be for real. You spend that on applications. Be for real. Y'all be spending $45 on stuff that's not going to make you no money. But when it comes to me, y'all don't want to spend no money with me. Blah, 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 but, you know, I'm not talking to you if, you, if that's you. But if you're like, hmm, the vision board, I already made a vision board. That's cool. It ain't really just about vision board. It's about actually accomplishing things in 2023. Actually understanding how to accomplish things in 2023. Understanding what it is that you actually want to accomplish. Some people just want um an image but it's not more than that it's deeper it's in your soul what do you want your soul to be like and i am having exclusive things at the end of the party that only the people at the party will know about so if you want to be exclusive you want to be a part of my community that i'm building i'm trying to help a thousand girls become influencers by the end of this year hello beautiful people i am now i think i was just on live and i didn't say not one curse word pat me on the back 2023, I'm trying to get that nipped in the bud, trying to get it down to a mini mom. But I'm back home and I'm about to cook my Hello Fresh. Today I'm making salmon. Good luck to me. Thank you for wishing that upon me. What is this? I don't know what this is. Uh, I don't know what this is, but it's, I gotta cook it. So. And I want me to mash potatoes. Mm, no, I'm not mashing potatoes. So instead of the potato part, we're gonna do instant. You know, I don't like cooking. It just takes too much time. <laughs> what is that? This is grass. I could have picked that up outside. The John mustard. Um, wine vinegar. Mm. What is this? Seafood stock concentrate. Ew. What is this? Sliced almond. Uh. And then we have the potatoes, the orange. And I'm assuming this is onion. The potatoes, you're not getting touched, Pookie. Sorry, but here's the potatoes. So yeah, first the potatoes we're gonna get. We're gonna get this. Here's the mint, the 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 meal. It say it take 40 minutes, but I'm pretty sure the potatoes is a big part of that. So it's gonna be not down to maybe like 20. Cause you have to physically mash the potatoes. Like mm -mm, I'm scared to taste this. <laughs> Salmon a la range. So it's like orangey salmon, pretty much. Yeah, listen to this. So released a song listen. on YouTube titled Slime Shit, where the lyrics state, hey, this is that slime shit. Hey, YSL shit. Hey, killing 12 shit. Hey, fuck a jail shit. Hey, cooking white brick. I'm not new to this. Hey, so I'm, I'm not new to this. Hey. I'm so true to this. Hey, I done put up a whole slime of a hundred licks. Slime or get slime. I'm in the VIP and I got that pistol on my hip. I'm so dead. Woo! Good luck to them boys. God bless them. Hey, you guys. So I finished cooking. Let me show y'all. So this is the salmon and the mashed potatoes that are instant in here. And I got this stuff, but this is the full thing. It just doesn't look pleasing on there. But this is it. I love freaking vegetable salad. My grandma be making this. And I just was asking her how do you make it. And she's like, you just put vegetables in there. And you um and you add a little vinegar and some salt. I'm laughing, okay. Then I have this jug. This has water and ice in it. So that's what I'm about to eat. I'm excited. I did not taste this though. This has a lot of stuff in it. Like it has lemons. Let me taste it. 
This grain tastes too green. I don't know about that. That's a lot of, that's a lot of leafies. Let me taste this orangey salmon. Y'all know I love salmon. Like, salmon my favorite food. It's, it's different. Okay, I'm back. I don't like this. I don't like this little thing right here. There's too much greens. Now, if it wasn't that many greens and it was like fruit and some vegetables, vegetables, not to eat it, but the salmon is gone. Would I ever cook it again? I would probably mix it up. I'll probably cook the salmon with different sides. It wouldn't be this. Excuse me. But yeah, I like the salmon recipe. I might keep that in mind like that. Yeah. That's the whole point of this journey. Is I'm figuring out what I like and what I don't like. Banning my taste buds. I got pork chop. I don't want a pork chop, but I got pork chop. I got one more meal. So I got this to eat again tomorrow. And tomorrow I'm gonna set out some more meat. So the next day. So the next day after tomorrow, I'm gonna cook again. I don't know. But that's a whole month worth of food. And like I said, I will see you guys tomorrow. Hello, you guys. Um, This is my protein that I'm about to eat. No, drink my bad. I went to the gym. Let me show you my gym fit. Uh, I hope I stay consistent. Y'all can't see. But it's just this tan. I mean, this is not tan. Mint, green, whatever. Pastel, I don't know. Color. And I'm about to make this. And I'm gonna, I'm talking to Ayana. Say hey. Hey y'all, go to the gym today, Ginko. <laughs> <laughs> we both is trying to get back into the groove from like how we was when we first met. <laughs> Ain't this the one you have? <laughs> All right, you guys, let me taste it. I already know what it tastes like. <laughs> but I put peanut butter this time, so I don't know. They like chocolate. Powdery <laughs> chocolate. Good, good morning, you guys. I'm about to take my dog outside. It is 8 o'clock in the morning, 8.10. I'm, about to, I'm watching this them defeat the devil's lies. Um, video that I, that popped up on my YouTube. So, yeah, yeah, I'm out here changing, breaking cycles. <laughs> it's so Stick sad. To God's truth. I'm back inside, y'all. I have finished my Bible study, my prayer. Good day, the, good day the, this morning. Good day it was today. But it's time to put my working boots on. My working boots on. What's up, what's up, what's up? I'm about to go ahead and wash my face. I'm about to wash my face. And brush my teeth so that I can work in my clubhouse today. Yay. Wow, beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. I also need to go shopping, but it is January 7th. Y'all, we get to the new year. Thank the Lord, thank Jesus, because OMG. I thought I would go back it on day one, on day two, actually. On day two, and then three, and then four. I was really shaking for my boots, you know, so. Yeah, so I decided to work in my clubhouse today so that I could have a different scenery, so that I could focus, because these past few days, I haven't been really working like that, because I can't. So I'm going to shift my area from home to the crib. And I need to also watch my videos on master marketing. Y'all went outside with this crop top on, but I have a jacket on, but I think it like affected me. But I also need a master marketing because I see my vision board right here and I look at it almost every morning. And discipline is doing what needs to be done even when you don't feel like doing it. That's a big one. Black women in luxury. I want to do more seminars or whatever they're called, but I just got to get better at talking. I'm 20, y'all. I turned 21 at the end of this year. Like, when, it, when it's July, I'm about to be 21. I'm about to be grown. This is a good mouthwash. Because sometimes when people don't know how to brush their teeth, it still it be stank. So you get this and that, it, it, it helps with the stank. So I'm going to wear this some jeans. Alright y'all, so I'm in my clubhouse and look at the pool. This is so nice. Like, I don't know if I'm going to move. Like if I'm going to leave. But look, I have this TV sitting area right here. Over here is cute. But I need like a, like I could work like right here. But that ain't really the vibe. It's like, look at this season. This is how I want my house to look. But they be having Pandora, but I just never could work it. So I'll just leave that alone. I'm either going to work right here or over here. I might work right here just for a new setting. Like I like this right here. Probably gonna put some YouTube on the TV because it's TV right there. Let me pull out my laptop vacuum. I'm getting a new cover. Ayana's getting me a new cover. Then I have my iPad. I have two two planners. This is a mock-up one. Well, it's not a mock-up. It's messed up. It's, not, it's damaged. Excuse me. So I use this in like my reels and stuff that I don't have to write. Excuse me. But if I'm gonna write in it, I'm using this one. But I got makeup on it. And I never cleaned it off, so now it's too late to come on. You know, the longer you let stuff 
day is sick. The worst it gets. So I got both of my phones. This is my work phone. This is my phone. So my camera ran out of storage, but I just went ahead and planned out a few reels. I'm about to record one. I already recorded that one, so I recorded two so far. I could do that third one, but I gotta plan that one out. So four reels. I don't have a notebook to take notes in, but I'm about to go ahead and film one of them. It's gonna be pretty, pretty easy. I'm really just gonna put the camera up. And I do have a real course, y'all. If y'all wanna learn how to make reels, I got you, Pookie Dookie. I didn't bring no phone charger, and my phones are about to die. Literally both of them. Now I gotta actually edit this stuff. So I think I'm gonna go ahead and do that. I'm gonna go ahead and edit it. And I filmed some surreal wealth videos and I was gonna edit them by myself. But that's not really striking my interest. Like, y'all, that is so time consuming. I'm about to go get me some breakfast now. It's two o'clock. I should not be eating this late. But I am. I'm about to go get some brunch at this brunch spot and make a mini reel about it. I'm gonna see how I can do this cutely. Um. But yeah, so I will see you guys in the car. I'm about to get ready. They close at 3 and it's 2.10. As long as I get there in 20 minutes, I feel like. Well, let me call because I don't want to waste my time. All right, y'all. They playing music, but I'm at the restaurant. Yeah, I'm going to show you guys my food. Hello, you guys. So I am done eating breakfast. I know that was probably the shortest clip ever, but it was good. Just straight. I was in there by myself. It was a little weird. I mean, I was just on my phone, so it wasn't like weird, but I want had I didn't I wasn't talking to nobody. Yet. I don't remember the last time I went out to eat by myself. So that means I'm always talking to somebody. But yeah, so I'm headed back home because I left the freaking Dior. How leave the Dior? The Dior was right next to my purse. How I leave it? I literally that means I looked at the box and just grabbed my purse and left. So I'm about to go pick it up so that I can return it. But in the meantime, I'm trying to think if I want to go and do something today. Because I might just be sitting in the house for the rest of the day. Um, and I don't have nothing to do at the house except more work. But, Pookie, I don't want to work all day. I'll do that later. Like, But I'm about to go and return this Dior, though. So, I'll see y'all then. Hey, so I'm going to be right back, okay? Okay? Okay, right back, Hazel. Right back. Go okay, y'all, I'm about to return to the Dior. Hey, you guys, so I got on a new gym fit. Yo, I'm feeling it. I'm feeling it. Y'all gonna see me in six months and be like, wow, that girl got a gym body. Like, I just want my waist snatched, body tone, like booty poking a little bit more. And I want my calf muscles to be busting. And I want my arms and my back to look good. It's like, easy, simple, achievable goals. But since I haven't ate nothing, all I ate was that stuff earlier and I was at like 3 p.m. five hours ago. I'm about to drink some protein. Got another slot on me, I like to get it poppin' But these bitches in my penis call me out to choose some violence If you see me out in public all right, y'all, I'm at the gym. But I have my AirPods in. I was wondering if I should work out with my AirPods in, but then I can't hear. So it's not like I'm at a gym. I'm at a residential area and like the street is right there. Like, I think people can, can see me. And what if I can't hear? Like that doesn't sound safe. Maybe I'll say the AirPods for like if other people are in here. But anyway, so I already did my upper body. I already did my upper body. I just look the fuck good. I just with myself like do y'all see this potential in the body do y'all see the 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 potential in the body do you like flat stomach poking out toned abs 
like but yeah i'm not gonna show y'all my upper body for real because i already did it i'm just gonna do biceps triceps i'm not gonna do my shoulders we're gonna do back and abs then after that we're gonna get on the stairmaster and so i'm gonna start showing y'all after the stairmaster i mean during the stairmaster because that's something y'all didn't see if you want to see my upper body you need to go watch my previous video but i'm on a stretch guys so now, i'm so <laughs> sorry i did not record but like my legs not shaking like when i used to work out my legs used to shake and it's because i'm not working as hard i'm by myself this is hard and boring like literally it's just me and the gym it's like a warm up for me. My this talk, this getting hard. See, I've been thinking I see results. I, I just been working out for two days, y'all. But yeah, it's just me here. My legs not shaking. They usually be shaking when I'm leaving out the gym. I used to be like this. I'm not doing that. But all I did was this machine. I'm gonna show you guys. I did both of those exercises because I forgot I was literally listening to the baby. And then I got on the stairmaster, like I told you guys. Was right here for five minutes. Five minutes, all I could do. But my goal is, cause I want to get a flatter stomach. So obviously, I'm gonna eat better. Obviously, that's step one. And then I'm going to do the stairmaster. That's the only cardio that I'm really gonna do. I don't want to be a runner. That is working for the heart rate. And then I did my quad, hamstrings, hips. I don't know what the side part is called. Hips and butt, glutes. I didn't do no calves. I this is calves, y'all. This is all you gotta do. If you want to work out your calves, this. And that's not hurt. Ouch. I'm just do it right now. It hurts. I dare you to stand up and start doing it. Tomorrow probably going to be a family day after I get done with my work in the morning. But, um, yeah, and then tomorrow night I'm going to be at Ayana House. So I'm going to tell everybody that I'm going to come over tomorrow daytime. And then make my to-do list for tonight so that I know. But, you know, we had a good workout. Worked out my arms. A little bit of shoulder. I went this way because I don't like walking out there. People can just literally grab me. They have to make sure y'all watching y'all surroundings. So y'all could be safe. Somebody was washing clothes. I smell it. Well, let me show y'all Hazel. Hey. How you doing? Hey. I'm so ready to eat. I'm ready to eat. Take a shower. It's so warm in here. All right. I didn't take no nap today, so I shouldn't need a melatonin. Did I? Uh-uh. Woo! All right. See you guys later. Next video. Today, I'm going to go see Ayana, but I'm actually about to head to church. This TV is too loud. I, I, put, I put TV on for my dog every day that I leave. But let me show y'all my church fit. This one wearing a church. All right, so I changed my shirt to white. But here's the fit. Here's the fit. We fit in. Hey, 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 hey. Bless me, bless me. <laughs> but I'm about to go. But I'm about to go and put on some smell good. She did boo boo outside. So that means that means I will come home to no boo boo on her grass. So I don't have to clean on no boo boo on her grass. <sighs> my office is so like. Messy. I can't wait till I grow out of this room. When I grow out of this room, baby, I need some more expensive perfume. Who wanna buy me some expensive perfume? But I'm so excited to see my friend today. Like I miss her so very dearly. Not not basing off of anybody else's experience. That's another thing I like to tell people. Like don't base your your relationship. Oh God with how other people, people's relationship is. Get out Hazel, is with God because everybody is different. So it's like, make it to your understanding to y'all's relationship, you know? Like, I don't really think there's really no like right way. There definitely is wrong, like, you know? But who are we to judge somebody on what they believe with their relationship with? Let's just let people's faith do what they do. Do what they want to do with and you never know you don't know what what level they are on in their journey yeah what area uh are they on in their journey i'm probably gonna take pictures in this same outfit this is cute my hair is like messed up real bad i'm gonna fix it. i'm gonna redo the ponytail later but for now i like the curls i like how it's looking it don't look too um defined or too big it's like perfect for me and yeah, so I got my jewelry on, my glasses on, and I just look 
real cute, real ready. So, we about to head, well, I might head out. Unique is coming. Going to meet me. Is my door not coming? She's going to meet me there. And I'm like, yeah, I will see you guys after church. I may or may not show you guys Unique because I don't know what she's doing. But I don't think I understand how much I love Ayana. Like, I seriously love Ayana. Like, she is a type of friend that I've never had in my life. Like, I've never had a friend like Ayana in my entire life. Like, no, no, no. Y'all doing too much, probably the ones thinking weird shit. But no, like, she is a different type of human being. That I met, she's, okay. I met a lot of real people in my life, right? But her type level of real is beyond no other level that I've ever, beyond any level I've ever met. Anybody in my life, I'm going to her house by the way, getting all my stuff together. Like, she loves hard. I met sh her and this boy that I met before that I was messing with. Love him. Love him to the death of me. He knows how to love. Like, those two people combined taught me love on another another spectrum of love like before them two people i didn't understand that love is supposed to be unconditional like i loved conditionally it was like times where i didn't love somebody because of how i felt or how they made me feel when all in all you need to love regardless them two people taught me that and i'm so thankful for them like to this day fortunately he's not in my life anymore like that it's by choice it's really not this is by choice crazy right it's my choice, but Ayana not going nowhere. If I'm ever, ever down, I know I can always, always call on that boy because it was more than, oh, we together now. You know what I'm saying? It was more than that. It was just always. It's unconditional love. And that is how I want people to look at me. I want to give people unconditional love. That makes me feel so good to know or to think that somebody feels that way towards you. And that's my mission for 2023. Unconditional love to everybody. I don't care what you did to me, how you made me feel. Love everybody. Love every human being. Seriously, like, nothing against you. Nothing personal because half the time people just don't know. People just don't know what they're doing. Like, you know it's bad, but you don't know about unconditional love. You don't, well, you know, okay, you heard of it, but you don't know for real. Some people never experienced that type of love in their life that I have experienced with two people. And I just say, I haven't even experienced it for my parents. Not to say my parents don't love me unconditionally because obviously they do. But I don't do nothing to my parents to the point where they shouldn't love me no more. You know what I'm saying? I don't burn, I don't break it to my mama house. I don't break it, you know, I don't do that. If I'm positive, I would have felt that unconditional love if I was that type of kid, but I wasn't. But for Ayana, I made her upset before she still was loving me, like arguing. I have the boy, y'all don't even wanna know what the fuck I did to the boy. The shit I did to the boy, he still loved me like. He loves me all of the time. She loves me all of the time. It doesn't matter. Like I'm about to cry, cause that is like true. That is love. And that is the type of love that I wanna give. I just wanna give that love to everybody like. Oh, 23, 23 is gonna be so good to me. Cause we're about to go with my girl tonight. We're about to have fun tonight. Oh, sorry. I'm also, I'm gonna take these dishes out of the sink. I just wanna come in here and tell you guys how much I love my friend and how much y'all need a friend like that in your life. Cut off the toxic friend that cut you off because you'd rather get your boyfriend. Never that deep. Y'all need to always love each other. Always show that love. Regardless, I'm so thankful for her to be in my life. I'm so thankful for her. Like, her and the boy pushed me closer to God. All right, I'm done, y'all. Let me let me do this stuff, and then I have a robe on, too, because I took my shirt off. I have a bra on, because I didn't want to keep wearing the shirt that I was going to take pictures in. And I also got to find a second outfit. So, I'll come back to you guys when I'm finding my second outfit. Y'all, I could not find no freaking outfit. Like, I have to go shopping. Like, I'm supposed to get some clothes on White Fox soon, so... I don't even remember what I ordered. I'm really a certified whoopah. That, you know. Uh, uh, uh. But I can't have no sweets for two months, y'all. We only is on day eight. I can't wait till they get, like, easy. Like, it's not bad because I be taking a supplement that helps with, like, cravings. But I've only been taking it for, what? Almost two weeks now? Almost two weeks now. So, it don't. It takes like a minute, maybe like a month in, then I really like feel like zero urge. Like I could see a cookie in my face and not care to eat. I'm 20, but I want to be married by 25. Like I hate to say that. Like I'm serious. 
I'm like so serious. I'm not kidding. Like I want to be married, settling down, in love, and that's five years. I can do that in five years. Like, okay, I can. Okay, because it doesn't take that long to know who you want to marry for one. For one. Like yes, you gotta get to know each other a little bit more and stuff. But okay, what can we get out of two years? Three years, I feel like. Three years, three, four years, I feel like it's a good time. So if I can meet somebody this year or next year or whoever I know now, whatever the case may be, and we get married, we can do that because I'm moving off of love as y'all as y'all uh, know. I mean, I still know how to get a boy. I know how to get a dude or whatever. I know how to get him. I know how to get him right where I want him. But I'm going to implement it with love. You know what I'm saying? Because Jesus didn't let people get over on him. Did he? <laughs> Y'all, don't listen to me. I really just be talking seriously. So, yeah, but I'm headed to see my friend. We're going to the movies tonight. We're going to go get some food. We're going to go watch a good movie. Yup, 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 yup. And, yeah, that's it. That's all I have to say. I just was excited about that. And, I can't wait to come back home so I can spend time with my fam, Dizzy. Um, yeah, I'm implementing that all year. More family time because I don't really be, you know, around them for real. I be trying to focus on making my money, which is cool. And, I'm, and I haven't been focused on making money that much in the last past week because I've been, like, a little down this week. But I need to get back on it. I need to see, like, what areas in my business need more uh, work and focus on scaling my business which means making more money and then scaling my youtube channel obviously it's you guys and yeah i don't know what to do with the youtube though because i am really too focused on youtube like i love youtube don't get me wrong <laughs> but as the real wealth i don't took three months off y'all i already know that it took me straight up out of that room oh my goodness but it's okay we're gonna come back i'm gonna post i'm upload and consistently i don't want to start on there and not be consistent like i did last time i want to be way far in advance of film videos so that's what i need to implement into my life hey you guys say hey hey y'all we made it we finally at the movies right now i'm yes. about to i don't like this i have came to the conclusion i don't like this bro i feel like i'm bulked <laughs> Like, yeah, it's cute though. It's gracious, thank you. I don't even have my mm -hmm. shoes on. I have freaking Yeezys on. This might, yeah. Gotta get your shoes right here. Yeah, but yeah. So, okay, this is kind of cute right here. Yeah, it is. Cause we, we, we. Let's hey just see. So I'm with Saria. Hey. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna take my pictures. I will show you guys. bag back yes so yeah so now i'm about to take her her first outfit then we're gonna eat they have food upstairs but yeah i seen it was like a food court we can see what they have they might have a lot of fried yeah i've seen johnny rocket so. i don't fried, know. Right? i heard of that but i don't know what they had what i've they never had, had it before either but yeah. it sounds fried i think they got like hot dogs hey, baby. Ooh, baby i should have brought my shoe with me <laughs> feet hurt all right i'm gonna show you i'll take it let me take her picture I'm on the loop, I'm on the way. Oh, I stay out the way. Got another shot on me, I like to get it poppin'. But these bitches in my penis call me out to choose and violence. If you see me out in public, you don't know me, keep it silent. In the bedroom, I be screaming, but outside, I keep it quiet. You know, I'm the I'm the lowest of the lowest. Don't say if you can keep it, and nobody knows. All right, you guys, we're in Colony Square. We are going to IPIC. We finally decided, but we are recording reels and stuff. All right, let me get my camera because they like that. All right, 
let's see good morning beautiful people it is monday and we are going to go get some brunch hopefully we can make fun a brunch spot that's good lace is through like i'm taking it out today for real for real for this time because it's just not giving no more it was cute while it lasted i you know made it worthwhile but we like i said headed to the city but yeah so i just want to come in here and say hey i'm gonna let my camera batteries charge while i'm driving so I'll see you guys at the destination. All right, y'all. We are at Old Lady Jane. All right, you guys. So we made it inside. Alright y'all, ooh, did I break my makeup? I'm about to show y'all me tasting this first off. I'm going to taste the mac and cheese because that's what I should have. It's smoking. I haven't had this in so long. Is this normal? This girl made her picture small. That way you can see how it's going to look. To see how look, it y'all, here's, here's a tip. Here's a tip. If you want to see how your picture's going to look, make it. Add the little image on there. Oh, y'all can't see what I pressed. Oh. oh. Where is it? Down there. Oh, yeah. This. Add your image. I already clicked mine. And then you just make it small and fit it to the square. So you can see exactly how it's going to look on your feed. Y'all you welcome. That is crazy. I've never. Y'all welcome. People gonna start doing they that. They are gonna start doing that now. It's like, why would you not? So you can see. I didn't even think of that. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I really don't know. I just did it one day. I was like, hmm, yeah. Wow. And then, of course, the picture wouldn't already be there. Exactly. So it would be like, I'm adding to it. But mm -hmm. in this case, it's already there. Well, go like her pictures because she, she said she put it in the wrong order. <laughs> so. Y'all, I wish I put this one, this other picture first. Yeah. But it is what it I is. I told her. What was you just doing? Tap delete. Keep in mind you must <laughs> <laughs> Leave me alone. What'd she say delete for? She said, I don't know. Oh, delete. Uh -oh. Then tap the three dots in the top right corner. I ain't deleting nothing. Hi, y'all. We're out. We wanted to see the, um, what's that? What? It looks cute, though. Oh, yeah, it's like wavy. A wavy vibe. Her hair. Yeah, you're welcome. <laughs> but yeah. Yeah. <sighs> we have so many more memories to make. I'm sorry, I was just thinking about that. For I was real. thinking about it on my birthday. Which one? The last, my last birthday. What? This How? last birthday. You don't remember? You have to. There's no way you forgot. Yeah, but this one. <laughs> <laughs> that was a long night. That was. What are we looking like? You like my hair? Huh? See? Nah, I'm gonna live here either. I should have brought, brought the I ordered these off Amazon a few days ago. I'm gonna tell y'all how they work. They're ashwagandha supplements. She got some more pills. Yeah, the ashwagandha supplements, it's supposed to help with like your stress response. Mm -hmm, so mm -hmm. it's just supposed to have me more calm. And a lot of people say it helps them think more <laughs> like, clear. Their mind is clear, not so foggy. Um, It's like a mood enhancer because you like. I was seeing videos on TikTok and they was pretty much saying they don't care about nothing. <laughs> like it just makes you. All right, yeah, I ran out of storage. Okay, so I got it opened up now and I'm about to put it on my computer. Dang, my computer all the way over there. Oh, sorry. Very good. You want me to get it? Yes, please. Yes, Cindy. Brand new whip got no keys. Tell them my clothes no, no starch, please. Soon as I you can go. go. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, look at the oh, three, no, look at the four. That's on there. 
Mm-mm. I was a little tired. I guess I, it's from one different tab. computer. Like, it probably fit. Because you, cause you got yeah. it, it fit yeah. different sizes. So this one's probably for... Because, oh, this. Yeah. That's you the only that? thing that's different. I remember... I don't be putting the bottom on there because... Open up. Oh, that's so cute. Isn't this one? Is that it? Yeah, it looks like it. I think it's the other way. Oh. It's not really, I can't tell from this side. That looks good, look at the front. Ooh. Period. Thank you. Oh, that's so cute. Yeah, that's cute. Okay, so this is the last one. Oh, wait, no. In the case. Yeah. I don't know if you're going to see it. Yeah. yeah. Oh, here's the screen cover. Mm, not the clean okay. That. Yeah. I'm like, I knew it came with a screen protector. Then it goes like this. I'm not doing that. I'll be realistic here. <laughs> <laughs> wow. This is so cute. Yeah, I like that. I like that. This is <laughs> nice. I like this. Thanks. You're welcome. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> yeah. Oh, my hair is out. Hey, took my hair out. Uh, right now, I've been home, y'all. I came home and got so bored that I had fun to sleep. Like, I was, I wasn't even sleepy. I was just bored. So, I took a nap. But now I'm back up and I'm thinking of YouTube video ideas. Because, for one, these videos need to be longer. Okay? That's for sure. So, if that means it has to take longer for a video to come out, then that's totally <laughs> That's totally found me. As long as these videos is hitting, I really want them to start hitting one hour. And I'm sorry to Kanaya that that's my editor. That's a long time, but hey, that means longer hours. <laughs> I don't know. Um, right now I am home. Like I said, I just took Hazel out. It is 6:49. I need to change the time on my stove because it's an hour ahead. But oh uh, yeah, it's it's about that time. And I got some more Hello <clears throat> Fresh. I got some more Hello Fresh. I'm about to open this up and put this up in the fridge. I got some Hello Fresh tonight, so I'm gonna cook some tonight. And I'm gonna go to the gym tonight. And all that stuff too. Cause I went to the gym yesterday with Ayana. I worked out my, well, it kinda do hurt. I worked out my triceps, my biceps, my shoulders, my back. Yeah, that do hurt. At first it did hurt. And my, ooh, my abs do hurt. I thought I wasn't sore this morning, but I am. But tonight we're gonna do lower body. So I'm going to make sure that I cook eat before the gym i might eat i might just drink a protein shake before the gym and then eat food after the gym along with another protein because i'm not trying to lose weight i'm just trying to tone up and slim down my waist but the only way to slim down your waist is to eat less because i know there's women across this whole world that can't cook and they grown and they husband finna lead them because they don't cook Okay, so this week I got three meals. I got sesame soy pork bowl. Ooh. I honestly need to put my Hello Fresh on pods because I I need to cook this. I have some more gonna be shipping out in two days, and I have four meals left to cook that I have not cooked. That's four days, and by that point, the new box gonna be here. This is crispy chicken cayenne chicken cutlets. Okay, wait a second now. This one might be busting. This one takes 30 minutes to cook, five minutes to prep. If, if they want me to mash potatoes, I'm not mashing. Why do they keep wanting me to mash potatoes? Like that's just, I'm gonna try it. Maybe it's more healthy than the instant. And then I have Southwest Beef Cavatappi. Southwest Beef Cavatappi, okay? So yeah. Oh, I can't have this, it has cheese in it. And that's nothing. Only thing with HelloFresh is you, they don't have, cause it ain't sponsored, they don't have a, where you could do um dairy free. Ooh. Feeling hung, still feeling hungry. Shop at HelloFresh Market for all your essentials. And then some breakfast, snacks, dessert. Oh yeah, I need breakfast meals. No cap. They have home cleaning. $40. Four hour cleaning. Part of overpriced cleaning service, try home glow. Better quality for less. Verified cleaners. Hold up now. HelloFresh. This is why they this is how they get you. They give you all these. All these benefits. So I'm gonna give this to y'all. Whoever use it first, go ahead and screenshot the front and back of this because I don't even know what this look. Okay. Screenshot first view. You better get it, girl. You better get you some Hello Fresh for for free. Screenshot and here's the back. Screenshot. So whoever use it first, 
use it first. Yeah, this is what I'm gonna cook tonight. And then tomorrow night, I'm cooking the chicken cutlets. What is a cutlet? And then the beef bowl, sesame soy beef bowl on, on a few days. Cause today's meal is gonna last me two servings. So that's tonight. So that's Tuesday, Wednesday, one meal. Thursday, Friday, other meal. Saturday, Sunday, sesame soy bowl in on Sunday. So Sunday, I gotta cook again on Monday. So my next cooking day is gonna be Monday. Well, no, I lied. My, after these, my next cooking day is gonna be Monday. So let me see when my Hello Fresh bowl, bowl arrives. They say, coming up, delivery by, oh, edit delivery. So it's gonna take about a week. Hello, I am about to cook. How, did, wait, did it even go in here to cook the green beans? Oh yeah. Are these garlic? camera had died and I didn't get to show you guys my food but I'm going to put a picture up on the screen it was pork chops sweet potatoes and green beans but I am probably gonna go ahead and this video I'll talk about a new one and I will see you guys in the next video bye